Y your Honor, please wait. Uh, Mr. Act, you better have a good reason for interrupting my verdict. Now, do you have proof to refute the witness's claims or not? Can I prove something like that? Do I really have evidence that he's been changing his channel's URL? Are you a lawyer? Or just a big ol' pussy? My entire case is resting on this moment. If I let up now, this hateful copyright abuser will get off scot-free. I have to think about this from a different angle. I don't need to prove that quantum apotheosis was banned. I need to show that he changed the URL. Mr. Act, if you cannot demonstrate the validity of your claims, then I'm afraid this wild goose chase will be nothing more than conjecture. Your Honor, I have proof. And, 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 uh, this is how you respond? You steal videos and you, you, you lie through your fucking teeth. OBJECTION! Mr. TV, the only thing coming through my teeth are straight facts! This evidence will prove beyond a shadow of a doubt that you're violating YouTube's policy on ban evasion. And here's my final proof! Take that! But... That's, that's the evidence Mr. TV just submitted as proof that he isn't ban evading? Quite the contrary. This link Quantum is using to prove his innocence is the very thing that will seal his fate. I don't know what the hell that's all about, but that's some weird language going on there. It's just all hearsay. Have you ever heard of the Wayback Machine, Your Honor? It archives websites across the internet to preserve their contents as they were at an exact point in time. These links can't be faked. Quantum claims this link leads to the missing channel apotheosis. So I asked myself, what would happen if I put this link into the Wayback Machine? There it is. Irrefutable evidence of ban evasion. Quite a remarkable coincidence. So what really happened? Quantum Apotheosis was banned for hate speech. Out of fear his other channels would be taken down, he privated next-gen gamers to prevent people from reporting it to YouTube, but forgot about it until just recently. Four years later, to throw off suspicion for his ban evasion, he found this video, made next-gen gamers public again, and changed the custom URL to the one listed in the description to make it look as if Quantum Apotheosis was never banned. If you look at the social blade for this channel, you'll see the account was active throughout May and June of 2018, but it was recently made public again on May 15th, 2022. You can also see there was a massive purge of videos. But before that, what was the last day Next Gen Gamers was active? June 12th, 2018. The day before Quantum TV himself confirmed his other channel was banned for hate speech. And here, Quantum shows in this Discord message how he privated this account for so long. Tell the truth. Quantum Apotheosis was terminated for hate speech, and you've been evading that ban for four years, using three separate accounts this whole time, and that's all the proof YouTube should need to enforce their policies and terminate the rest of your active channels. Admit it! You're ban evading!